chung rìm xuống Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen On behalf of His Excellency Kete Sitabandit John Prasad Senior Minister, Minister of Industry, Science, Technology and Innovation I am very honored to join this event today which is timely and important at this difficult time when the world is still faced with the challenges of the COVID-19 pandemic. Micro, small and medium enterprise are strategically important for economic growth in developing countries such as Cambodia. MSME provide over 70% job and contribute to uh, GDP around 58% of Cambodia in 2018. Supporting MSME is not highly relevant with economic growth and sustainable development of the country. It is also critical to ensure income and livelihood resources of the vulnerable group of people, especially women and youth. The majority of MSME in Cambodia concentrate their business in the manufacturing, tourism, retail and service sector that are highly vulnerable to shock brought by the COVID-19 pandemic, which has affected continuously of MSME from both demand and supply side. From the demand side, for example, the lockdown and the international travel ban imposed internationally to cure the spread of the virus has resulted in the substantial reduction of tourism arriving in Cambodia in 2020. Likewise, it has also brought disruption at the supply side, stopping timely provision of raw material for apparel, footwear, and garment manufacturing factory. Facing the challenge, it is said to note that a number of MSME were forced to close temporarily. To support business continuity of MSME, the government of Cambodia has launched very effective measure this included the deployment of stimulus measure of US around two billion USD that provide low interest loan tax relief MSME and other related issue, direct cost support to the employee. This measure would not only support MSME during the emergency response Pace to COVID-19 pandemic, it is also expected to achieve long-lasting impact, improving resilience of MSME in the recovery and rebuilding pace after the COVID-19 pandemic. For example, the government has provided skill training program to reintegration of employees who lost their job due to the pandemic partnership with the private sector is also pursued to diversify business model of MSME for enhancing their resilience toward COVID-19 and other external shock in the future. Planning and implementation of the policy have been following an inclusive approach. The high degree of informality among MSME in Cambodia have been well recognized compared to their formal and registered counterpart. Informal MSME tend to benefit less from policy support from the government to support their continuity and resilience as an integral part of MSME sector in Cambodia. The Ministry of Industry, Science, Technology and Innovation has proactively led the building of the coherent and simplified MSME formalization mechanism in Cambodia. At this point, I would like to thank the Department of Economic 
and social affairs of the United Nations, Yuen Desa, for their tireless effort in supporting us building the mechanism. Thanks to the support of Yuen Desa, the mechanism has been established and policy guideline was published, which provided a clear roadmap for um, SME entrepreneurs on step and requirement need to register business efficiency. I believe the policy guideline would contribute people clearly to improving policy environment for MSME growth in Cambodia. Ladies and gentlemen, one lesson learned from the COVID-19 crisis could be that the virus know no border. The world need solidarity to work together and protect MSME job as well as hard won progress toward sustainable development. This is the relevant to developing country like Cambodia as to developing economy. The Ministry of Industry, Science, Technology and Innovation, Cambodia would embrace partnership of every kind of international organization and national partner to further improve policy environment for doing business in Cambodia and jointly support contribution of MSME in Cambodia to the resurgence surgeon of economic growth and sustainable development after the pandemic. I would like to wish the event a smooth success and I look forward to continue partnership and getting in touch with you after the event. Thank you. Awkward.